I would like to demonstrate how to configure Rapid SCADA to connect by OPC standard. OPC is a widely used standard um, helps to connect different devices and SCADAs. Manufacturer of devices creates OPC server application and SCADA software connects to the OPC server as OPC client. The default configuration of Rapid SCADA consists the settings um, that could be used as a template to create your own new configurations. I would like to show these settings. Open the administrator application that is used for editing the configuration database. Open communication lines table. You can see the second line named OPC. Open devices table. Uh, there is the 21st device named OPC demo. There are input channels for this device. Open the communicator application and go to line 2 OPC. Mm. You can see that device state is normal and there are random values of the device tags because I have installed a simulator of OPC server made by Metricon OPC company. Now I am going to add a new device to the configuration of Rapid SCADA. For example, you mount a new device, connect wires and need to receive the data from this device to Rapid SCADA. Go to communication lines table, add a new line. OPC 2. Go to devices table and create a new device. OPC demo 2. Choose OPC device type. No address and call number are needed. There is now the newly created communication line. Just click refresh. You can group OPC devices in the communication lines differently. This is not important in case of using OPC. Click apply to finish cell editing. Pass the changes to SCADA server and restart server service. I have done the preliminary configuration of the database and need to continue with communicator. We need to input the configuration the communication line. It doesn't appear here. Reopen the shell.
try again. Line 12. Now display it. Let's input. No communication channel type is needed because OPC provides its own communication channel. If you're planning to send comments, tick this checkbox. No custom parameters. Select the item and click device properties. We are waiting for the form uh, which allows to configure the properties of the specific device, device 103, that we recently created. Select OPC server and click connect. Data specification is default. In the left side there are contents of the OPC server. There are a tag tree. I will choose randoms, random tags. This panel contains tags of our device that we need to receive. Create data group active checkbox allows to switch on or switch off the tags these fields uh, depends depend on the MPC server You can change update rate and dead band. Double click the tag to add it to the group. Save the configuration and close the form. Apply settings of communicator. Now we can restart the whole service or just start the communication line. Let's check the state. State is normal. Communication line lock is OK. And we can see some data. Now we have to create input channels for the device. Go to service, create channels, choose the device, select an object. I know that channel numbers starting from 200, 2000 are free. No output channels are needed. Validate channel numbers and click Create button. Channels created successfully. Close the tool and let's check the channels. There is a channel that was created. Path changes to the server. Restart the server. And restart the communicator. Make sure that the cell contains channel number will be not empty. Okay, 
it is not empty. Let's check the data. Open the shell of SCADA server. Go to files, current data. Open the data. There is our channel number 2001. We have learned how to create the configuration for OPC devices. Thank you very much.